Think that you're Tom Brady. Think that you're Nick Foles. All you are going to do when you serve is you are going to think that you are throwing a ball. Again, think quarterback into it, the end zone. Don't think uh, pitcher, right? You don't want to throw down. You want to throw up, right? So watch. When I throw this ball, I'm throwing up. I'm lofting it, right? I'm throwing the ball from the outfield to the infield, or I am lofting the ball into the end zone. I am not throwing like a baseball pitcher and down, okay? I want to throw up. The reason why I want to throw up is because for the serve, you have to go up. It's a throwing motion, okay? Now, Tyler, I'm going to get so many comments if you guys watch my videos. The serve is not a throwing motion. You do not throw the ball. That's crazy. Kinetic chain, all this BS. No, the serve is a throwing motion. I will fight any single coach out there. It doesn't matter. Talk as much smack as you want. If you are a club level player, if you're watching this video, if you're a beginner, intermediate, club level player, you are not playing for prize money or playing Division I, Division II, maybe Division Three tennis. The serve is a throwing motion. Again, if you're super advanced, it's not, but if you are a club level player, it is, okay? So what you are going to do, and I want you to do, is just get three, four, five balls, and all you are going to do is going to be trying to loft the ball up as high as you can, have it bounce, and try to have it bounce over the fence. So I'm going to be here, I'm gonna line up, and I'm going to loft the ball and try to have it bounce over the fence. Let's go. So I'm gonna do it again, and I'm gonna throw the ball up in the air and try to have it bounce over the fence. Let's do one more. Okay, this fence is pretty high, I can't do it. But if the fence was lower, it would be much easier, right? So now, what are you going to do? You're going to get your racket and you are going to do the exact same thing. So, I'm going to pretend that what? I'm lofting the ball over the fence. I'm lofting the ball over the fence. I am lofting the ball over the fence. Now, Tyler, you're telling me to throw the ball up in the air so high, how are you expecting to get the ball down? Well, after you loft the ball up over the fence, next thing I want you to do is after you're done, watch, I'm going to throw it to you guys. I'm not going to throw it far because there's a fence behind us, but watch. I'm going to loft the ball up over the fence, and then I'm going to follow through across my body. I'm going to loft the ball over the fence, and then I'm going to follow through across my body. By following through across my body, it is going to bring that ball down. So again, when I serve, I'm going to what? I'm going to loft the ball over the fence, bring the ball down. Loft the ball over the fence, bring the ball down when I hit. By doing that, that's going to ensure that I get that ball in the court. By following through across the body, think that you're a pitcher, think that you're a quarterback, you're going to throw across the body that's going to bring the ball down. Now, you want to get more pace, you want to get more consistency, right? All you're going to do is just be looser when you throw it, okay? Too many players, their serves are wrong because they stop and they have a pause, right? If I throw, right, if I throw a ball and I pause, it's not going to work. So, if you ever feel like you have a pause, also, if you feel like you hit the ball in the net, you're going to do this drill. Again, you're going to just let the racket go. You're going to let your hand go up. Watch, let's do one with the ball, one without the ball. Watch the same motion. Feel free to rewind. Exact same thing. So again, next time you're on court, if you have trouble with your serve or if you wanna improve it, think that the serve is a throwing motion. And again, when you throw the ball, you're throwing the ball up. You're not throwing the ball down like a pitcher. If you guys can implement this in your tennis game, you will be able to have a better serve. If you guys have any questions, comments, concerns, anything, please let me know in the comments below. Have a good one, guys, and